Here we go again, doing the thing where I watch K-pop. Hello everyone and welcome to this video. I'm Shelby. Welcome to Shelby Shuffle Mode, where I talk about music. This channel is fully dedicated to music, so if you are interested in that, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. That aside, today I am watching some more K-pop. I have made one K-pop reaction video, which I will have a card to that right now. I've learned some things and uh, spoiler alert, I still know hardly anything about K-pop, but the biggest thing I learned in that video was I kept saying, there are a million people in these groups, so many people, and then in the comments you all informed me that, oh, I was mistaken. Those were smaller K-pop groups. So today I am focusing on K-pop groups that have even more members in them, but I'm actually really excited. So I picked three groups that I am going to look at today. One is a girl group, and then there there are two boy groups, boy band groups, boy groups, yep. I picked two boy groups, so I'm gonna stop talking and we're gonna get right into it with the very first group I'm gonna be watching today. And the first group I'm looking at today is NCT, which Google told me has 21 members in total, 21. So they have four subunits of NCT. I don't know any more about like how they choose or how they rotate or anything like that. But yes, they have four subunits and the song I'm looking at today is from NCT 127, which is a subunit, I believe, and it is called Cherry Bomb. Okay, Cherry Bomb. Okay, so this subunit, I'm going to try counting how many me members are in this subunit. Oh. Oh. Okay. So, is 127 like the hip hop unit? Or is this just like one of their concepts? I'm slowly learning the lingo, but I have no idea if I'm using it correctly. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, it's hard to count them all. Two. God, I'm gonna guess nine. There are nine people in this unit. Oh. I'm the biggest hit on the stage. I think that's what they're saying. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. Okay, they are bringing swagger. Lots of swagger. Ooh. We just entered a totally different phase of this song. This sounds like a totally different song now. Serious vocals going on there. This song has got a lot going on. Okay, now we're dancing. There's been less dancing in this one. Okay, I spoke too soon. We have now hit the dance break. Wow, there is a lot happening in this song. This song, you're, I'm gonna have to listen to this song like a hundred more times to like really understand what's all happening. Okay, now we're back to the first part. It's gonna be stuck in my head all day. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. They got a lot of vibes happening. 
I'm like not saying much because I'm just trying to like absorb. There's like a thousand things happening and I'm very confused. Oh, okay, I can count them now. Okay, nine, I was right. How long are they gonna go? Wow. Whew, I got a lot to take in there. I feel like I need to rewatch that at least three times to really get everything that was going on. That was so incredibly different than most K-pop I have seen up until this point. I liked that interlude where it was like totally different than the rest of the song with some really cool vocals and they definitely had more like rap, hip hop and they were giving off not so much like they were just like a like a we don't care kind of attitude like they weren't doing as much smoldering per se they're more just like we're confident we're cool are there any songs where you have literally all 21 members i tried finding one and i was struggling to do so so please let me know in the comments how that works like do these subunits come together or is it like you have this group of 21 members and they kind of like rotate around the subunits but don't really like all come together at once. Please let me know because that is a concept that I am really just not used to. Next up we are gonna watch Seventeen. Seventeen was referred in the comments of my last video and they have all of the people doing all of the things in their group. The one thing I saw about Seventeen, and I was trying to figure out how many members they have, which by the way, they have 13 members and three, uh, three subunits, yes, 13 members, three subunits, but they do all work together. They really own their music, so I'm really excited to see this. They apparently really own like the choreography, the writing, the production, everything. So I am very excited to see a song by them. Okay. Windmills, sustainability, I'm into that. I can already tell I really like the music. I really like music. Ooh. Okay. I really like this vibe so far. We got lots of dancing. They move very fluidly. Fluid, 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 whatever, fluid. <laughs> okay, they are into the dancing. I like their style of clothing. It's a bit more real. I like that. Okay, so, so far, this music video feels like very authentic, real, less sci-fi-esque that I've seen in some of the K-pop videos. So I'm very much a fan. You can really hear their vocals too, which I like. This is so... Wow. I like this song. It's the dancing once again is incredible. And now we got our little rap break kind of rap. I'm not gonna lie, I really was afraid I wasn't gonna like understand how you could have this many members. But I feel like everyone's getting their time to shine. They are very good dancers. I really enjoyed that. Seventeen, you pleasantly surprised me. This was like, I think, the most understated music video I've seen yet, which I honestly really like. Like, 
their outfits were a bit more like common streetwear and but they still had like amazing dancing awesome choreography i really enjoyed the singing in it 17 i really liked that and they have shown me that you can have like a lot of people in your group without it being overwhelming and i also really appreciate that so you know what i'm gonna check out more of their stuff <laughs> All right, so the last one I'm looking at is a girl group called Twice. They have been around for a decent amount of time. I think I saw 2015, don't quote me on that. I could be wrong, but um, there are nine members of this group. And as far as I could tell, they don't have subunits. Do they have subunits? I don't know. Let me know in the comments, but I don't think they do, which for nine people, I find pretty interesting that they don't. So the song I'm going to look at today by Twice is called Fancy. So here we go. Twice. Fancy. Mm, it's got a lot of views. We are back to whimsical, colorful K-pop land. I can already tell that. Oh yeah, we are back to pure pop K-pop. Yes. This is what I think of when I think of like traditional K-pop. Oh, this is like pure fun pop right here. So colorful. Oh, here we go to the dancing. This is like, I don't know how else to describe it other than this is what I think of like the most traditional pop pop of K-pop. Like that stuff that's addicting that just gets stuck in your head. This is, this is very different from Blackpink, who I looked at before, that's for sure. Oh my gosh. So much color. There's a lot happening. This is going to be stuck in my head for the rest of the day. This just, you can't help but smile watching this. It's just like, oh, so happy. But I can hear their voices, so I appreciate that. They're on a roller coaster. Oh my gosh. This is just pure pop. Put the pop in K-pop. <laughs> wow. That puts the pop in K-pop. That is the best way to describe that. That that was like I mean, I know I said it while I was watching it, but truly that is like what I think about when I think of K-pop without knowing it beforehand and seeing like how it really does vary a ton. But when you think of like super traditional pop, poppy music, poppy K-pop, that is what I think of. So, and when you're in the right mood and you wanna just have a good time, it is good to have some songs like that. So, good for you twice. I consider today's K-pop round two a success. I feel like I actually may have found a group that I want to explore a little bit more, 17. I heard a lot of vocals that I liked. I heard some really good vocals. I had like a really fun dance pop number with Twice, and then we had some hip hop with NCT 127. I still don't understand the whole subunit thing because there were nine members there, but there's like 21 in total and nine members is still a ton of people. Yeah, 
definitely saw a lot of different vibes today. I enjoyed it. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. That would be wildly appreciated. If you're watching this and you are a K-pop fan, not all of my content is K-pop related, but I do like to explore it as well as I like to explore many other areas of music. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you are interested in music-based content, that would be just amazing. Let me know in the comments if you like those songs or go ahead and teach me more about K-pop. Once again, I'm all about learning and being educated. So let me know your thoughts in the comments about anything K-pop or those groups in particular. That'd be wildly appreciated. But once again, thank you for watching and until next time, bye.